What is going on guys? Welcome back to another Kyle for a Wild video or fishing the Florida Gulf Coast. You guys already know. Now in today's video, we're going back to the roots. A lot of you have been requesting this and it's this time of year, sheephead. We're going to be doing some sheephead fishing in my brand new Old Town 120 Topwater PDL kayak. That's a mouthful to say, but uh, this is the kayak that I made a video on a couple months ago. I haven't been able to fish in it a whole lot just because I, my truck has had a lot of issues with it. Um, I actually had to just drop $4,000 on a brand new engine for my truck. So that's why you haven't really been seeing a whole lot of videos lately. I've been working my butt off trying to pay off this engine and that stuff like that. So things come up, you know, accidents happen. And yeah, sometimes you just got to make the best out of it and get, get back on your uh, feet. But I'm really excited to show you guys this video. Uh, me and my buddy Corey went out sheephead fishing. We, have, we caught a variety of species. In the beginning of the video, I'm going to be showing some clips of, of some redfish and black drum and stuff like that that we caught. But later on in the video, keep on watching. Sheephead do show up. We, we don't just catch the redfish and black drum and stuff like that. Keep on watching to the end. A lot of sheephead action. And I uh, hope you guys enjoy it. Um, I was using a size 4 J hook. Size 4 J hook. A 3 8 ounce lead egg weight. And a uh, tiny, tiny swivel with about 20 pound test. Sometimes you can bump it down to 15. But you got to be careful going too, too light on the sheephead. Just because if you do have a sheephead on and it hits that pylon and your line's really, really tight. Um, it, you know, it's going to snap really easily if you're not using at least 15 or 20. So yeah, we went out there, had a good little sheephead trip. And uh, yeah, it was, a, it was a lot of fun. And I'm going to be doing a lot more sheephead fishing here in the near future. So if you guys love sheephead fishing and all that, make sure to subscribe. I have a ton of videos on my YouTube channel of sheephead fishing and all that. So be sure to check them out if you guys do enjoy sheephead fishing. And also, if you do enjoy this video, make sure to drop a like. It's free. It helps this video reach more and more people. If you guys drop a like on it, it helps the YouTube algorithm. And uh, yeah, thank you so much for watching. And I'm Jibber Jabber, and I've been talking to you guys zero off. Sorry for these long intros. You guys know how I do these intros. I get really carried away sometimes. But no Jibber Jabber, let's get in the video. It's a black drum. All right, guys, Corey is hooked up. Corey's got something. I don't know what it is. I think he said it's a black drum. You said it's a black drum? On that jerk bait? Really? How about that? That's awesome, man. That is so cool. Look at that, guys. You need a net? You probably need a net for that. Here, let me give you my net, Corey. Just relax, man. That is awesome. That's so cool. You want me to get him in the net for you? All right. Bring him this way. There we go. Nice, man. Little black drum. Look at that on the soft plastic. How cool is that? Now go ahead and pedal to me. Keep on going. There you go, man. Go ahead and take that sucker. Beautiful fish. Here, you can grab the net, bro. It's all good. Sweet fish, man. Did you just did you just sight cast him? No, he was just down a little bit deeper. Just hanging out in the pylons, huh? Uh, that's the thing, guys. You know, whenever you're sheephead fishing, these black drum, you know, they hang out with the sheephead hang out too because they're just like sheephead, even though they don't have the teeth. You know, they like to hang around areas with a lot of oysters and barnacles. They're they're kind of like crustacean feeders, so that. So they, you know, blue crabs, barnacles, oysters, stuff like that. But uh, here, let me see that bait real quick. That's the bait right there that got him, guys. Nice, man. Here, I don't want you to get that tangled up. Cool fish. That's what I'm talking about, man. Sweet job. Oh, uh, you want to show them off for the camera? Yeah. Cool, man. That is awesome. Sweet, man. That is a nice fish. You got to keep them? Yeah, we can. It's up to you, man. You want me to get a good picture? Yeah. Okay. I'm going to get my camera out, guys, and uh, we're going to continue to head out to the sheephead spot. Beautiful fish, man. That's awesome. All righty, guys. We're over here sheephead fishing. One of my favorite things to do, guys, is sheephead fish. I absolutely love sheephead fishing. We're going to be fishing with fiddler crabs. I think I may have just got a bite already. Nice, man. There you go. Here, bring him over here. So much bird crap, man. Bring him on over here. There we go. Nice, man. Here. 
there you go. That's what I'm talking about, man. Nice fish. Corey's on fire. He's close, man. Oh yeah, he's definitely slow. Beautiful fish, man. Look at those dots, dude. Yeah. That's good work, man. Awesome fish. You got that fiddler crab? Yeah. Nice, man. That is. All right, cool. Nice, man. So Corey measured his redfish, ended up being 20 inches long, so definitely a slot redfish. That's awesome, man. He's got a black drum and a redfish. That's cool. Uh-oh. I felt like a bite. I'm on! Oh, that's a, that's a good one, boys. That's a good fish. Oh, it's a nice sheephead. Nice sheephead. I need to loosen my drag up a little bit. That's a good fish, boys. Woo! Broke the ice on the sheephead. About time. Goodness gracious. I've been trying to catch these things for like two hours. And I there was one that kept on taking my bait uh, right here for like five casts in a row. And finally I got them. That's a, that's a good one too, guys. That's not a bad sheep. Oh yeah, perfect hook set. I wouldn't say perfect, but he wasn't going anywhere. So what I'm gonna do, I got the old pink pliers. <laughs> I'm not lying, these are my mom's pliers. I thought I left my tackle box at the house this morning and it turns out it was in my kayak the whole entire time. So we're gonna go ahead and keep on trying that and uh, we'll get back to you. Y'all drop a like on the video if y'all are enjoying it. That's a bite. That's a, that's a fish. Oh yeah, what is that? Woo! What do we got on here? Oh, it's a big sheephead. Holy cow. Holy smokes. That's a big sheephead. Sorry if my lens is kind of fogged up. That's a good sheephead, boys. That is a really good sheephead. If I can get him in here. He's not ready yet. He is not ready yet. That's a good sheeper. Come on, bud. Oh, how do we? How are we gonna do this? No, nope, ah, don't you go that way. Come over here. Don't you go that way. Oh yeah. Hey, number two. I just had to let Corey know we're on number two, boys. There we go. What I love about this kayak is whenever we hook them at these pylons, um, I can just backtrack. I can just put it in reverse really quick and just pedal out of there so that way he can't get me in the pylon. But that is a good sheephead. Let's go ahead and get him off the hook. That's definitely a slot. Nice. I thought for sure that was gonna be a sheephead. It's all good. It's all right. Corey asked if he wanted to wanted to take a picture of it. If he wanted me to take a picture of him. Not a bad, not a bad fish. I'm surprised he even got that hook in him because I didn't I was not ready for him at all. I need to get the There we go. Beautiful fish. Pensacola slot red. Corey.
All right, boys. Beautiful Pensacola redfish. Corey says you see a, he sees a piece of floating wood. I'm gonna head over there to him real quick though and measure this redfish. And see what we got going on. All right guys, Corey just got him a nice sheep set as well. Nice one, man. Beautiful fish. You catch him on a fiddler crab? Yep. That one's a little darker than mine. That's it's awesome. Um, is that your second one today? Yep. Nice, man. Good work. That's what I'm talking about. Throw his it's butt back. Cooler. Yeah, that's right. Right on, guys. We are getting them. I'm on. I don't have it on camera, though. My SD card's full. Guys, check out that sheep head right there. I don't know if it was recording or not, but just got another. Whoa! Just got another nice sheep head. I don't think it was recording, but if it was, you guys got the fight. But 